So, hi, I'm here with Hannah Trigwell, who just played a great set on the main stage. So, firstly, how are you? How are you doing today? I'm good. Uh, yeah, I'm really good, actually. It's really hot, and that's cool, but uh, I always wear black on stage, so it's, you know, it's not ideal, also. <laughs> cool. How did you think your set went? I saw you, you played um, an acoustic set at Sofa Sounds as well, um, and that sounded awesome so how do you think both of them have gone how, how have you been liking the crowd at Lee Fest? the crowd is amazing um, at both stages I really enjoyed the so far sound stage um, I really enjoyed the main stage as well but the so far sound stage was like really if I want to say a different word from vibey but it was vibey um, I think just mainly because the audience is closer um, and it was a bit more intimate but it's a little bit more detached when you're on a main stage because the audience is further away and there's the barriers and stuff, but it was really cool. Um, and I got some really positive feedback for my new stuff, which is great. Oh, that's great. So um, have you been doing much of the festival circuit this season or have you? is this your first one? Give me the mic. <laughs> um, <laughs> yes and no. I did Isle of Wight Festival. Um, I did Grey Escape in Brighton. Um what else have I got going on? I mean, I've been doing not as much as last year on the festival circuit just because I've been recording a lot and a lot of the time I've been in Germany. We, we've just, well, I've just done a guest vocal on a track that's been released by a German electronic duo called Juno in Park. Check them out. And then, um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I haven't actually been around as much in the summer as I have before. But yeah, I always love doing festivals and live shows. And so you've been playing a lot of shows in Germany, right? Um, I, I've done a few shows in Germany this summer, but it's been mostly recording, so just not as many shows this year, really. And how do you how do you think the German vibe is like similar to the London UK vibe, or what are the differences? Is there anything you like more about Germany? Ooh, God, I don't know. Um, the, the Germans clap more during a song, like they will clap on the beat more. Um, I feel like sometimes the UK audience is just like, we're, we're very cool, we don't want to clap, <laughs> almost. Um, but yeah, the, the, there's not that much difference, to be honest. Sometimes um, just the German crowd may be slightly more, they like to get more involved. Um, the UK crowds, I, I really love because the UK crowds will just tell you, tell you straight up, like, if they like the song, you'll know about it, and if they don't, you'll know about it. And with a German crowd, it's just like, everything's great, which is great. So, yeah, yeah, I love playing in, in both. I've done a, a couple of uh, kind of mainland European tours, and Germany's always a really cool place to play. Cool. So if you, were, um, if you had to describe your sound to someone, how would you, how would you describe it? This is always a super hard question for me. Um, because I play in so many different setups, and recently it's just been mostly me with the guitar and loop pedals and stuff like that. So I would say it is pop. It's pop music, but it's guitar-driven, kind of chuggy, electric guitar kind of pop music, as opposed to, like, bubblegum pop or... It's, uh, maybe it's indie pop then. Yeah, that would make sense. So, kind of following on from that, if you, like, I want to kind of ask the whole who are your influences question, but with a bit of a twist. So, like, who would you see yourself as, like, being in a few years' time? Like, who would you look up to and would think, oh, that's what I want to do? Um, ooh, I, I love Ellie Golden. Maybe I would be, God, maybe, hopefully, I would be kind of a little bit like that, maybe more guitar slightly less electro version of that um, I absolutely love her stuff but I, I don't see myself ever going not ever hmm, actually now that I think about it maybe maybe I will go fully electro no I don't know I, just at the moment it's not completely electronic it's really a lot of guitars going on so maybe just a more guitar version of Ellie Goulding hopefully you know who knows <laughs> So have you got any more shows coming up in the summer or coming up next year? Um, yes. I have a few that I haven't announced yet. So look out 
on www.hannahtrigwell.com forward slash tour or I, I list all of my live dates and stuff on Facebook and all that kind of thing but apart from those dates that I haven't announced yet no because I'm going to be recording again so yeah I have some new singles and hopefully a new EP coming out shortly so I'm just working on that at the moment great well we'll definitely keep in touch and stay tuned for all the new stuff thank you for taking the time to chat with us and have a great festival thanks, very much. thanks.